probably like one of the most popular spots here. A lot of people line up here and shit in the morning and afternoon. There's actually like lineups. We're near closing, so it's not too bad. But yeah, they make the bread fresh and you get a pretty good size sub for seven bucks, eight bucks. Sorry, their iced coffees are really good. Oh yeah, the Viet Vietnamese iced coffees, man. Oh, Lee, man. There you know. Got the big shoes playing too. Is it straws too? Oh no. I have it, I have it. Oh, you got it? I don't know which one's with. Oh, we, we can sell it, man. Yo, like good Vietnamese iced coffee, man. I wish they cut this in half, man. They don't cut it in half, man. You, okay. don't, get, you don't get that. Someday. Okay, so I have some shoe pickups, sneaker pickups, footwear pickups, whatever, that I've picked up over the last like year, probably like end of 2021 until now. Obviously, you guys not took like that break, so there's just like a bunch of footwear that I got that I never showed. The first ones that I got, which I actually returned, were were some Asics. They were they were called the Asics UB2S Gel 1130. So these were actually like an unofficial Kiko Kostadinov collaboration. So I think he had a hand in like designing them, but they weren't like under his name or they weren't like a collaboration. If you like look it up, it'll say like, I think he helped design it or like do the colorways or something. So they're super fire. I really like the look of them, like the way like um, the silver accents and just kind of like the shape of it. Like I feel like they're better than most ASIC sneakers that I've seen and they felt like the most wearable to me. They're on sale. So I ordered them, I ordered like a black and silver pair. And then when I got them, I don't know, something about them. They were like too small on me. Like they fit me, but they were like, they looked too small on my feet. And I didn't really have any like pants that really went with them. And it just didn't really complement like my f type of fits that I wear. If they were like maybe a little bit chunkier, I feel like they would have worked, but they were just kind of too like slim, I guess. Like I don't know the right word for it, but so I pretty much ended up returning those. Um, but I did take some like B-roll, and I think I'm pretty sure I have some clips of me wearing them. Um, so I'm just gonna show that on the screen. But these are super fire. Like I definitely was like in it, I was trying to find like some sort of uh, not dad shoe, like like you know that New Balance kind of look, like those type of shoes, like hike, like retro hiking. I kind of slept on Asics for a long time. Like I always knew that, like about the gel lights and all that stuff, like I always knew about it. But I was never fully really got into it. And I knew about like the Kiko collabs and all that. But then I saw these and like, these were like pretty affordable. And on the website, it looks so nice. Like if you look at like the product photo of it, it looks fire. But when you get them in person, it looks kind of different, like the shape of it. But yeah, those weren't for me. But if you guys want them, I'll put a link to it. You guys can grab those. But yeah, I, was, like, I think that was like one of the first shoes I copped this year 2022 like it might have been like january or it might have been like december 2021 after those i think after a couple months i ended up getting these chuck 70s which i haven't actually worn that much i've probably worn them like 10 15 times um but these are just like some classic like the black and white or like the black and kind of off-white cream color chuck 70s and i got these from essence they were on sale for like 70 canadian i think i'm like yo like i used to wear like chuck 70 i used to wear like converse back in the day i, I feel like everyone has had a pair of converse in their life i remember when i was in grade five i saw lil wayne wearing like a red pair of converse and then i ended up finding a red pair and i felt like low wayne so i feel like everyone's had that connection with converse it's probably like the most classic shoe of all time so so i might as well get a pair it's like a classic essential to have and yeah one thing about them though i feel like i honestly feel like i got a, got too big of a size um i don't know what size these are actually i think they're like eight they're size eight and a half i'm like a size nine but i was reading on like reddit people are like oh go half size down because they fit big but i should have got eight because they do kind of look big on me either that or like i feel like i haven't broken them in yet properly so i think i just have to wear them more but i definitely like them they're super classic like you can just throw them on with like anything and like they're acceptable anywhere so i definitely messed with those and they were like 70 bucks so like you can't beat that next pair of shoes i got i think in february were these sambas um everyone knows about sambas <laughs> i was actually trying to find sambas like um in early 2021 I saw this is a clip of like Tyler the Creator and Frank Ocean like in New York somewhere like there's on the side of the street and I saw like Frank wearing like this like long coat and he had black sambas on and I was like yo I want sambas and then from that day like I kept trying to find them but the only place they had them were like these random like soccer like websites and they were kind of sketch and I was like 
I'm just not gonna, I'm just gonna wait until they can go on Adidas, but like they were, they kept being out of stock on Adidas, and like I just couldn't find them for the longest. But like now they're making so many pairs. I feel like they are getting like they're getting like really super hyped right now. But yeah, it's cool. So I got those white ones from uh, Adidas Canada. I think I paid like let me check how much I paid. It was retail, but I paid a hundred dollars Canadian. That's kind of the theme right now in this whole pickups video. Like everything's like a hundred dollars around a hundred dollars. So yeah, those are super fire. Uh, wear those a lot. Thing I like about getting shoes that are like around a hundred dollars, I can just beat them and I can get another pair if I need to. And then I actually ended up getting another pair of sambas i got these black ones so those ones are like the adidas originals ones it has like the blue like the adidas logo on the tongue and then these are like the soccer ones so like these have like like the tongue on it it has like that shit so i got these from uh, adidas outlet in seattle when i was down there um and i got these for like i think 50 or 60 dollars usd so like 70 canadian i think um these are cool as well definitely a different shape like you can tell like you can definitely tell the difference on the shape these are more like flat from the front and these are more rounded i actually originally wanted these the black ones because like that frank ocean video i was talking about i got the white white pair and the black pair now and i wear both of them pretty equally i was it took me a while to figure out how to like not wear it like this i know like the whales modern ones have like the whole tongue on it but i just don't like it so i just i like, kind of tucked it inside of it like that it actually looks kind of sick i like how this how this looks it looks kind of like designer designer vibes but yeah, I wear those two a lot. Last but not least, I got some Yeezy slides in the black colorway. I don't know the name of it. Pretty dusty because I wear these like every day. These are like my go-tos. Like whenever I'm doing anything, I just like put those on real quick. They're super comfortable. Like they're like the foam runners. Like, like when I got the foam runners, I was wearing those so much. And now same thing with these. Like if I have a chance, I'll throw them on. Um, obviously it's gonna be winter now. So it's gonna be raining and snowing. So I probably won't wear those as much. But in the summer, I was like, as soon as I got them, I was, you know, I kept putting them, like, put them on, like, every day. Um, so, I actually got those for retail from the Adidas Confirmed app, which was, like, 90, 90 Canadian, I think. And the cool thing about that was when I, I always, ent like, always enter all these raffles on the Adidas app, but I never won anything. And then I entered for these ones, and then also, like, the, the like, the beige color, I think it's called Bone, or something like that. Um, I entered for both of them and actually won both raffles. So, I ended up reselling the other ones, like, the, the Bone ones. I resold them for like double the price, so I pretty much got these for free. I never win raffles. Like the only raffle I've ever won was like the the Travis, Travis Scott uh, Jordan Fours. Those are my little shoe pickups, footwear pickups that I've got in this year. I have a couple more I want to get. I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a wish list video or like a wish list segment within a vlog. But yeah, those are my footwear pickups.